What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. We're here in Horizon Zero Dawn. Now so far all the gameplay that we've been doing has been no commentary, no nothing, just straight raw gameplay. If that's something you guys have been enjoying, make sure you guys let me know, hit the thumbs up button. Uh, if it's something you want to see me play with commentary, make sure you guys let me know. Um, or if you want to see both, if you want to see me upload one video with commentary and then I could upload the same thing without any commentary, I can definitely make that guys, you know, happen for you so but right now we're here sitting at the map so you can see the map map on this game is just absolutely huge uh, we're still at the beginning of the game you know doing a brand new walkthrough so but in this video here we want to be going we're gonna go over the skills menu so let's go ahead and tab over to the skills menu here so we can see what we got now you can see we got 11 skill points so just like any other game you know you earn skill points from creating missions and just playing the game and you know you'll just get skill points they'll just come to you as you play the game so uh, so what we got here is we got 11 skill points so pretty much what we're gonna do is we're gonna knock out this first row first so we're just gonna go through and grab all these go through them one by one see what we're gonna get so uh, first up we got silent strike press R1 to perform a sil silent strike takedown on small machines and humans that's definitely gonna come in useful so we're gonna go ahead and learn that uh, so far all the way up you know if you guys have watched the previous videos you know I've had I think I got three or four of them up right now we have not earned a single skill point so we've been doing all these game all killing all these robots machines whatever you want to call them with no skills whatsoever so uh, what we're gonna let's see here what do we got hunter reflexes slow motion while jumping definitely need that definitely need that uh, silent drop land from a fall or jump is completely silent and will not otherwise blah 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 and going ahead and get that uh, next up what do we got here concentration while aiming toggle with right stick to slow down time definitely could have used that in some of the uh, prior videos uh, critical hit uh, yeah definitely could have used that especially when we were uh, taking down that big whatever that big spider thing was in the last video uh, precision light spear attacks have an increased chance to knock off armor that definitely come in handy lure call so use the exclamation mark from the tools menu to so pretty much it's like a whistle you know like if you guys have ever played any of the Assassin Creed games you just you know you get in the bushes you know, let out a whistle and the guys you know just walk over towards you so healer uh, speeds up healing from the medical pouch that's definitely gonna come in handy Right now it's fairly slow, so gather uh, additional natural resources when foraging. Okay, so we're going to get some, some extra stuff from... Okay, so we don't got to pick up as many plants and stuff. That's always good. Uh, scavenger, chance for extra resources. Uh, so what are we down to? We're down to... Okay, so we can only pick one. So let's go through and read them and see which one we want to get up here. Uh, chance for extra resources when looting down enemies. Herbalist doubles the capacity of the medicine pouch. That could definitely, definitely be good. Combat override. Increase the time a machine will remain overridden. Which, in the last video, we just, uh, you know, we just got the little machine, you know, so we could start overriding stuff. So, that'll come in handy. Uh, precision plus. Light spear attacks have greatly increased chance to knock off armor. Critical hit. Critical hit deals more damage. We might have to go with that one because I can definitely see that helping us out here. Heavy lifter moves faster when wielding a heavy weapon. Don't think we really need that right now. Uh, further reduces your visibility. That's nice. Balanced aim. Use ranged weapons while balancing on ropes. Oh, we might have to go with that. Strike from above. Press R1 to silently drop and take down small machines and humans. Ooh. Uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be tough. It's gonna be a tough, uh, tough choice here between these two because these two, I feel like are really gonna come in handy right now. Uh, low profile that might be the next one. Critical oh, man, it's gonna be a hard, it's a hard decision. It's a hard decision. Let's just uh let's narrow it down to these two. So strike from above or balanced aiming. Uh man, I think this will. Strike from above would be nice. Uh, I think we're going to go balanced aim. Let's go balanced aim because that will add a little bit more, I think, versatility to our movement. So let's go ahead and go with that one. Boom. And there it is. We've gone through all our skill points. 
Make sure you guys let me know if you like that. Uh, I'm going to make another video explaining each tab, you know, notebook, quest, map, crafting, inventory, all that good stuff, even though we are, you know, we kind of went over the map. So I don't think I'll do a separate video on that. But if you guys liked it, hit that thumbs up button. Leave a comment down below. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Really help me out, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.